Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I created this pink eye for you guys and I just smoked out the bottom lash line and I paired it with a bright pink lip. I really love the way that it turned out so I really hope that you guys do too. And if you are interested on how to get this makeup look then please keep on watching. Okay everyone, let's go ahead and get started. So as you can tell already, I did my eyebrows. I also went ahead and primed my face using the Professional by Benefit. And I primed my eyelids as well. And I used the MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot for that. So we're going to jump straight into the eyes. And I'm going to be using my Naked 3 palette from Urban Decay. And I'm just going to be grabbing a blending brush. This one is by e.l.f. And I'm going to be going into the shade Nooner, which is this really nice color right here. And I'm just going to start working that into the crease. Once I'm done blending that into the crease, I'm going to be going into my Love and Beauty palette from Forever 21. And I'm going to be picking up this pink shade right here. And I'm just going to start building that on the crease and slowly start to buff it out and blend everything together. And for that, I'm just going to be using a skinny blending brush and I'm just going to go right into that pink. Once we're done blending the pink into the eyes, it's going to look more of a purple since we did add a little bit of a darker transition shade to begin with. And now I'm just going to go back into my Naked 3 palette and I'm going to be picking up the color Limit and I'm going to mix it with a little bit of Strange and apply that on the lid. And then going back to the blending brush that we used, I'm just going to go back and blend everything together. Now I'm going to be doing a winged liner and I'm going to be using the NYC liquid liner. And now that I've applied my eyeliner, I'm going to be applying some mascara to my lashes and I'm using the Maybelline Volume Express Mascara. And for lashes, I'm going to be using my Ardell Wispies. I am so in love with these lashes. Okay guys, and now that I'm done applying my mascara and my false lashes, I'm going to be moving on to foundation. And today I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible and I am in the shade 105, which is natural beige. And I'm just going to apply this all over my face with a damp beauty blender. Okay, now once I'm done applying my foundation, I'm going to be jumping in into concealer. And for today's concealer, I'm using my Instant H Rewind from Maybelline. And this one is just in the shade Neutralizer. And I'm going to apply this under my eyes, the bridge of my nose, forehead, cupid's bow, and a little bit on my chin. Now that 
that I'm done applying my concealer, I'm going to be setting it with my Laura Mercier Secret Brining Powder. And I'm going to be using my Beauty Blender for this. And while I let that sit and bake for a little bit, I'm going to go into my Kat Von D Shed and Light Palette and I'm going to start warming up my face. And today I'm going to be using the shade Subconscious and I'm just going to be applying it with my Hula Bronzer brush. I'm just going to start carving out my cheekbones. And with the other shade next to it, Shadow Play, I'm going to be applying this to the rest of the face. Top of my forehead, my temples, and also along my jawline. And now with a fluffy brush, I'm going to start blending out the cheeks. going to be dusting off the excess powder from the under eyes okay, and for blush I'm going to be going in with a wet and wild color icon and this one I don't have the name for I accidentally removed the whole sticker that came with it and it had the name on there I don't see it anywhere in the back I'm going to be looking for this one and I'll link link it down below with the rest of the other stuff and lightly with a blush brush I'm going to go in there and just apply it to the apples of the cheeks okay now I'm just going to contour my nose a little bit you don't have to do this I like to do it just because so I'm going back into the shade and light palette using subconscious and I'm just going to work this on my nose Okay, now I'm going to finish off the rest of the eyes and I'm going to be smoking out the lower lash line. So first I'm going to go in with a black liner on the waterline and I'm going to do the upper waterline as well. That way everything is just really tight line and well put together. I'm going to be using my e.l.f. eyeliner for that. Now to smoke out the lower lash line, I'm going to be going back to the Naked 3 palette and I'm going to pick up Black Heart and I'm going to be mixing that with the pink that I used from my Love and Beauty palette. Now I'm actually going to pick up the pink first and apply that and then I'll go ahead and start building up the black. Okay, and now going in with Black Heart. I'm going to start just packing this on on the outer corner of the eye. Now with a blending brush, I'm going to start blending that out. Okay, once I'm done blending my bottom lash line, I'm going to go back with my liquid eyeliner and I'm just going to bring down my eyeliner line from the top a little bit further down that way I can give myself more of that cat eye effect okay now I'm going to be applying some mascara to my bottom lashes and I'm using this mascara from Lancome okay once I'm done with my eyes I'm gonna go into highlight and I'll be using the NYX illuminator this has been my go-to lately and I'm just going to be applying this with a fan brush okay and for lips today I'm not going to be lining my lips I'm going to be applying the NYX soft matte lip cream and this one is in the name Istanbul so let's see how this works So 
this is it for this makeup tutorial today. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this look. I had so much fun creating it. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And also follow me on my social media. I currently have a Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram account. So if you're down to follow me on that, then you're more than welcome to. Everything used in this video is going to be listed down below as usual. So yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will be seeing you on my next video. Bye.